Hey YouTube, it's Jake, the Ticket Leprechaun. Super excited to share with you guys what I got today. It's a rare item. Uh, it's not something that's usually in my wheelhouse, but something I have wanted for years, and I finally found one. Uh, so first, a little bit of, of background, of kind of what it is to give you guys a, an idea of what I'm talking about. Raise your hand in your card room if you know what this is. It is a Redman tobacco card. Uh, this one specifically is a 1953 Redman Andy Pafco for my Braves. Okay. These cards were inserted in packs of tobacco as a marketing tool from 1952 to 1955 by Redman Tobacco. And their whole thing was get these for your boy. Okay. So they were trying to get adults, adults to buy Redman tobacco. Uh, so that they would give these cards to their kids, okay? So on the back, you can pause it here and read the whole thing if you want. I'm going to read a brief synopsis of it really quick. Uh, it says, plus a big league style giveaway, let's say, free of extra cost. So for those of you familiar with the set, you already know this, but this card is actually missing something. At the bottom of every one of these red man cards, there was a tab. And if you cut off 50 of the tabs and mailed them in to red man, they would send you a baseball cap of your choice. Now, I only have one of these cards that actually still has the tab, but here is that card. Happens to be Murray Dixon. But that's what the tabs look like. I'll zoom in on that a little bit. That's what the tabs look like, that you would cut off, collect 50 of, and send in to Redman to get that. So I, I will read the whole thing here on the back. It says, new for 53 Redman's famous extras for baseball fans. 52 full-color picture cards of Redman's all-star Major League Baseball players. So each year there would be 50 or 52 cards, 25 or 26 from each league, AL and NL. Okay. It says, plus a big league style baseball cap, free of extra cost. See below. On the other side of this card, this side, is a full color picture and story of one of the 52 famous Redman All-Stars. 25 top players from the American League and 25 from the National. All personally selected by editor J.G. Taylor Spink of the Sporting News. Plus 1952 World Series managers. Collect these pictures, trade with your friends. Remember, they only come in packages of famous Red Man chewing tobacco. And here's the special Red Man bonus. A big league style baseball cap at no extra cost to you. Just cut off and save the stub below. And mail them to Red Man Box 68, Toledo 6, Ohio. You will receive a baseball cap with the insignia of your favorite major league team. Be sure to print your name and address the name of all of your favorite major league team and your cap size, small, medium, or large. This offer expires March 31st, 1954, which was early in the spring of the following year because they released new sets of Red Man until 1955 was the last year. It says Red Man Chewers, start a collection for your boys. And on the tab, it says cut along this line, save this valuable stub for your Red Man big league baseball style cap. All right. By now, you know why I'm making such a big deal, probably, out of these Redman cards. You also notice, I believe this may be the only video of mine I've not worn a hat. So without further ado, the very, very rare addition to my collection, a 1952 to 55 Redman cap of the Milwaukee Brewers. Okay, so these are very rare. Uh, I have only seen them at auction house a few times, and it's always in groups of them. Usually half the set, whole set, you know, all 16 caps. I had never seen a Braves one by itself. I had never seen one on eBay by itself. Uh, so when this popped up, I jumped all over it. 
so excited. It came from a, sh a sports card shop in Wisconsin. Makes sense uh, since it's a Milwaukee Braves hat and it's old. So if this was a 1952 to 55 cap, it's the year 2020. That means this hat is 65 to 68 years old. And I'm gonna show you guys some close-ups of the condition so you can kind of get an idea of it. To be this old, look how nice this is. Hopefully I'll be able to get some without uh, my shadows in there. You know, a little bit of stain on the, on the bill there. But you can tell this one's authentic because the, the M's a little bit off center from the stitching. And I'll show you guys a, a couple other ways to tell. Um, it is a fitted cap. They were lined in this faux leather. And in this particular one, there is virtually no cracking at all. I mean, it's, it's in immaculate shape. It's pretty stiff because it's so old now, uh, but it is authentic. The other way to tell, you can see this is a size large. They're usually stitched, not along the correct edge. Okay. So, I mean, it is in, and this is the red button. There was a red and a tan button version. So, so excited. Uh, I'm going to wear this sucker one time, take a picture, and, uh, then it will live at home in my display case. So let's see if we can carefully put this thing on for the first time. It may not fit my head very well. There it is, Milwaukee Braves red man cap. Hope you guys enjoyed checking out this unique video. Until next time, keep collecting and God bless.